What's up guys, I'm back here with a Tifa review. Um, now over the weekend I saw a whole bunch of new stuff, uh, new TV shows, new series that's coming out, so I thought I'd give you guys part of my quick thoughts on them. Um, I saw maybe three or four of them, I'm going to review each one of them, starting with Lethal Weapon. Um, now Lethal Weapon, obviously is based off the movie Lethal Weapon. Uh, this TV, the pilot, mm, I have to say I do love Damian Wayans, I'm a huge fan of his, I own all the seasons for my wife and kids love that dude even love his son um and i guess he's funny in this role i think i don't i really wish this show was called something else don't call it lethal weapon i think they're going to call it lethal weapon only because um they think that that'll bring the audience but it didn't work for charlie's angels it didn't work for uh, Rush Hour, so I don't think it's going to work for only the weapon, and I do think this show is going to get cancelled, especially if it's on Fox. Um, and I don't really care for the dude who's supposed to be playing Mel Gibson's character. Um, so I think that, um, and not to mention the whole thing with his wife too, I mean, here's the thing, okay, I don't have kids, I don't know how this is supposed to work, but I'm assuming that if your wife is going into labor, she don't fucking drive to the goddamn hospital. I'm pretty sure you get a friend or someone else to drive her because I guess the way she died, I thought, okay, that's fucking stupid. I mean, I know it's what you feel empathy and everything. It's like, oh wow, he lost his wife and his unborn child. But I felt like it's pretty stupid. She's like, uh, I'm driving to the hospital. <laughs> I don't know where fucking truck kills. Obviously, it's supposed to probably have something to do later on with the plot that maybe they killed his wife on purpose or something like that but I feel like that's just a stupid way to do it you know um, I think personally I think what I probably I mean I know this is fucked up <laughs> you know I, you guys think how crazy my mind is but I think it would have been better if she died during childbirth and maybe um, the child didn't make it either you know it probably would feel more um emotional you know maybe you know make it more like he had nothing it was out of his control you know that's just personally what i think should have happened um you know or maybe don't, i don't know it's just so that's kind of took me out of it also i thought his humor the 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 i forget the guy who's playing him but um what's his character's name Ah, anyway, that's supposed to be playing Mel Gibson's character. I really didn't think that he had chemistry with uh, Damian Wayans. Um, I think the reason why Donald, uh, Danny Glover, and um, and Mel Gibson worked together is because they had good chemistry. They worked off each other, and it was very funny. As I mentioned, that is part of uh, *Lethal Weapon* is by far one of my, my top ten favorite trilogies of all time. I do, or I think not trilogies, but franchise of all time because they made four of them and I love each one of them and I I hate the fact that they're even remaking this the same thing there's about to remake fucking Beverly Hills Cop don't do that okay so um overall I think maybe I will watch next episode but um I do see this show getting cancelled I don't think it's gonna last especially it's on fucking Fox I say 13 episodes they cancel like everything you know so again if you guys like this review, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And uh, I really guys hope you guys will check it, you know, just check it out. Just at least check out the pilot, see if it's for you. Um, and subscribe to the channel. Peace out.